Hey guys, so sorry if I seem rushed because I'm in just a bit of a hurry. This is a look that has been requested numerous times. It's the look that I was wearing in my Lumine Makeup Remover Review. Um, so many people have requested back then, some are still requesting it now, so I'm doing it now for you guys. So I hope you enjoy. I've already applied Too Faced Shadow Insurance all over my lids. So now I'm just going to grab this Victoria's Secret um, Gilded Eye Pencil. It's just a gold one. You can use anything. Um, it doesn't even have to be a gold one, but since this is like nice and shimmery, it's going to look really pretty underneath the shadows. Okay, so I'm just spreading that all over the lid. It's going to give a nice sticky base for my shadows to stick on. I'm just going to smooth it out with my fingers real quick. Now I'm going to take this really light, almost like a pale gold color. This is from a Jane Duo that I don't think even exists anymore, so just use any light gold. And I'm going to apply that all over my inner lid. The lighter it is, the more bright your eyes will appear. I think people requested this look because they liked how it made my eyes look brighter. So just apply that on your inner lid about a mm, little over halfway. Alright. Now I'm going to take this pretty shimmery forest green color. This is just Maybelline's Antique Jade. Take a nice fluff, fluffy <laughs> um, blending brush and apply that onto the outer edge. It's actually really pretty. And just softly blend that all in. Kind of bring it up just a little bit. Right, make sure it's even, looks good. Alright, I'm just going to take something a little bit smaller and dip it into a black shadow. I'm just using Nexus Black. And I'm just going to define it a little bit more. Kind of deepening that green, defining the outer V just a little bit. Just blend it in really nicely. Okay, it looks good. I'm going to go ahead and put my highlight color on. I'm just going to use the other side of the brush that I used to apply the gold. This is the e.l.f. brush, by the way, that I love. I'm going to use NYX's Cream Cheese. It's a really pretty cream color. Nothing too shimmery. And I'm just going to apply that all over my brow bone. Blend it in with the other colors to soften it up. Right, I'm just going to apply a little bit of that cream shadow stick underneath my lash line too. All the way in. Now you can use the gold for your inner corner. I'm actually just going to start off with the white since it's a bit, um, well, more of like a cream color, the color I used to highlight my brow bone with. Since it's just lighter and brighter, Go ahead and apply that on the inner corners. Just open up your eyes some more, brighten them. Okay. Next, I'm going to go ahead and dip it into that light gold. And just continue that on the center. Blending it in with the white. And then next, the green that I used on the outer corner of my outer eye. Just 
Blend that right in. You can connect it if you like. All right, I'm actually gonna take an angled brush. There is it. And I'm gonna dip it into the black. And I'm gonna apply it on the outer edge, right, pretty much where I applied the green, but above it a bit, so the green still shows a bit. It's just gonna deepen and shape, give my eyes a bit more shape up here. So you don't want to completely cover the green, but just try to go above it. Okay, just like that. Alright, now I'm going to line my upper lash line. I'm just going to use my Alme Black Liner Pencil. When I'm quick on the go, pencil is usually what I like to use. Okay, line as close in between your lash line as possible. I usually like to have it thicker on the outer edge. And then thinning it in as I go. Really quick, small strokes. Like that, same with the other eye. You can set that with a black shadow if you'd like. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and do it. So take my NYX black again and my angled brush and just set set the black liner. That actually helps cover any spots that you might have missed too. Okay. Now what? Um, curl my lashes. I'm actually going to do it the normal traditional way this time. Alright, let's use Lash Blast. This, this is a new tube of Lash Blast because I ran out of my old one. And I don't know why I strayed from this. I really do like it. I was in my whole trying out different mascaras phase, but I really do like Lash Blast. I just feel like it amps up my lashes really fast, and so I like that about it. Also on your lower lash line, or lower lashes. That's about it. Um, well, I kept my cheeks really natural because from that video, I can't really remember what I had on that day, but it didn't look like I had much blush or anything on, so I just used this really pale pink blush from NYX. It's an angel. And on my lips, it looked like I had like a light nude pink lip on, so I'm, I have Jane's Not So Innocent Pink lipstick on with just a bit of sheer gloss, Victoria's Secret Beauty Rush. And that is the look. I hope you like it. I will have pictures coming right up. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.